Hey everybody, what's going on? My name is Tim. I am the Dizzy Daddy. Good morning. I just dropped the kids off at school. I'm back at the house and I need some breakfast. But uh, if you saw my last couple of videos, I was mucking around with some squid. It was very involved. It was very down and dirty. This morning I just want something really simple, really delicious, and that means Korean street toast. Let's go! Okay, so when we're talking Korean street toast, we have some basic ingredients here. We got our bread, of course, just normal white bread, whatever you can find. Eggs, of course. They always use processed cheese, American cheese, and then some kind of luncheon meat. So today I've got some low sodium spam. That's always kind of fun to uh, play around with. And Korean street toast always has veggies in the egg mixture. So today I'm just gonna go with this kale slaw mix. So let's get the eggs mixed up and we'll get going. And we're gonna do about half a cup of loose packed veg per egg. And we'll just mix that up. Okay, moving on. Let's butter up the griddle here. And get our toast going. So. Like that. A bit more butter here. Alright, just gonna do both sides buttered and let's put our egg mixture down so this is going to be two egg patties we'll just get that going first and we might as well get the meat sizzling up Believe it or not, we're pretty much done. Let's assemble. Depending on who's making this, I've noticed that they use all kinds of different condiments. So I like mayonnaise. And I also like this okonomi sauce. No, this is takoyaki sauce. Same sort of thing. So I'm gonna do this for this layer. This bad boy goes on the first layer here. We will adorn him with a little bit of meat. So our spam goes there. And then, middle piece. We're gonna go with some sweet chili sauce. I didn't have any, so I just whipped this batch up. This is loose enough that you can put it into a uh, squirt bottle, but I didn't bother. I just put it straight into a dish. And I'll put the ingredients and directions uh, below. So you can have a look at that if you want to whip up some quick sweet chili sauce. And this, more meat. Oop. I like sweet chili sauce. Okay, let's cut up this monstrosity. Oh, my goodness, my goodness. Okay. Let's give this a go. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, it's so good. It's like kind of trashy, but kind of healthy. It's, it's playing games with my mind. Mmm. Now the veg in here is usually I believe they use like shredded cabbage and um, a little bit of uh, shredded carrot sometimes. But I basically made these with anything. Um, I always use coleslaw mix just because it's easy. I'm lazy. But you can use anything. Ah. 
Ah. Oh. Oh. Good morning. And there you have it. Korean street toast, double decker my way. Oh man, I needed that so bad. Oh, I was so hungry this morning. I'm not usually a breakfast person, but this morning I needed that badly. I haven't even taken off my hoodie yet. I came in and started making this thing. So that was a quick one today, but still amazing, still delicious. And these things are not only delicious, but they are trendy. If you look on YouTube, you can see Korea's amazing street food culture, and uh, these are front and center. And they're sort of a staple, I hear, anyways, of uh, commuters in the morning before going to work. They stop at these sort of food trucks or stalls, and they grab one of these, and they're good to go. So I will be coming up with some more stuff for you. I will be updating my 44 to 24 fitness journey. If you haven't checked that out yet, maybe give it a look. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell, and I will see you next time. Take care.